Hi everybody, this is Aaron at TheRuggedStore.com. Kyle. And today we've got the FC55 Summer Rugged Tough Book. We are showing off how to install some of the X-Packs. Uh, the modularity of the 55, being able to upgrade it post-factory, is one of the biggest selling points for the 55. And we are going to show you how to install an optional interface into the rear expansion slot of the 55. It's right up here at the back. we got the 55 turned over, uh, belly side up for you. And this is the first time we've installed this X-Pack, so bear with us. You know, we're kind of discovering all the... Uh, Fun things together. So I'm going to hand this to Kyle. He's going to take out these screws, removing the dummy plate of the 55. Meanwhile, I'll talk to you about the instruction manual. So in these boxes, it'll come with you know all the screws that you need if you needed any. Um, if you wanted to reuse the screws, you can. You know if it doesn't need any extra screws, but also comes with instruction manuals. The ones that aren't just slide in um, ability like the extra battery on the instruction manual, it'll have a QR code. And so I'm going to show you the QR code here. Take a picture with my phone if I can. That's going to open up a URL <clears throat> and it's going to bring you to a website and that website has all of the different instruction manuals on how to install these X-Packs. So super easy, accessible. If you have a, something that can utilize the uh, QR code, you know, it will pull up. You just find your correct X-Pack, and I've already downloaded it, I'll download it again, and it has the instruction manual. And again, you know, this is pretty straightforward. Remove the screws, pop it in, put the screws in. Just make it sure it seats well in, uh, on connection down here so you get a uh, good contact on your, all your pins. And so the thing that should be noted is from the factory, the image that's with the FC55 um, should have all the drivers you need. You shouldn't really need any downloads for any of these X-Packs. It should just be exactly plug and play, secure it with the screws, check it in the BIOS, and we'll show that to you in just a second as soon as Kyle's finished, and uh, you're off to the races. So it comes ready to be upgraded from the factory, and it should be really easy. So this one has a serial port, VGA port, and a RJ45 uh, port. So the FC55 doesn't come by default with any of those ports, and the... Um, X-Pack is going to add that. And again, this is on the rear. So the side. only thing it actually <clears throat> comes uh, by default with that is it does have a LAN port already. The RJ45 on the expansion is a second LAN option, which is required for some individuals. Okay. Thanks for correcting me, Kyle. So we'll fast forward this part as uh, Kyle secures the screws. Then we'll show you it booting up in BIOS and checking his install. Make sure he did it right. Okay, now we're uh, booting into BIOS to check to make sure that the uh, computer is successfully installed with that X-Pack. Um, just make sure that before you install any X-Pack, you have the computer completely booted down, um, except for the optional second battery, which can be um, put in as hot swap. You don't need to power down the unit to slide in that extra battery. But any other X-Packs that we're installing, including this one, power down the unit, boot up into BIOS by starting the computer and hitting F2 immediately after starting it. We're going to go down to the expansion areas, uh, just hit down a few times and select it. And it shows that I have the front expansion area occupied by the secondary battery and the rear expansion area occupied by this interface option X-Pack. So successful install, the computer's registering it, it has the serial number, the correct serial number and model number for that X-Pack. And all those ports should be live and active, ready to be used, you know, for the serial VGA and LAN. And that rear expansion port can be um, a few different X-Packs that can be installed at that rear expansion port. I'll put it over my shoulder, Kyle's shoulder, somewhere where we have some free space to list those out. The next video that we're going to show you is how to um, install into the media bay battery. Or, sorry, media bay slot. But if you have any questions about the FC55, want to purchase one, or just want to check out other rugged equipment, we're always ready to talk to you at therugstore.com. We appreciate a like, share, and subscribe if you could. And uh, yeah, we look forward to talking to you. Bye-bye. Thank you.